Discovery Park is being transformed tonight for the 2024 edition of Aftershock. The Rock Music Festival is set to bring in acts including Iron Maiden and Motley Crue across four days. Aftershock is billed as the largest rock festival of its kind in California. It draws tens of thousands of people to the capital city. Yeah, the events then followed by the three day Golden Sky Country Music Festival in case area three's Andres Valle spoke to local businesses on how they're preparing for a busy two weeks. It's crunch time for festival crews as they assemble the stages for the Aftershock Music Festival. And businesses are ready to cash in on the thousands of people expected to visit Sacramento. It's been kind of slow lately, so just to have that little push of, you know, something fresh, something new, new people, um, it'll be fun. So everyone will be excited. Pam Nelson with Alaro Craft Brewery in Midtown, excited to showcase her locally brewed beers and dishes to visitors. And I feel like it just adds to the whole vibe. You're here for a festival, so you're here to enjoy the whole community. Um, and I feel like it just kind of brings a different vibe and a different community into the restaurant. <laughs> And the impact is being felt at other businesses too. I know, we do love it. Uh, the foot traffic is amazing. The people are so supportive. Sacramento really shows out for the big parties. Tipsy Putt in the downtown Commons is hosting Aftershock's official welcome party. Roughly 300 people are coming out. Uh, they're going to crash the back green of ours. They're just going to be hanging out, partying, having some drinks, getting hyped up for the big show. Aftershock is followed by the three day Golden Sky Country Music Festival. Visit Sacramento partners with the promoters to include farm to fork restaurants as vendors at the festival. Camden Spit and Larder is one of the restaurants featured. We've done that a few years now, so it's nice to actually have the restaurant at the event and be part of it and also be open here at the same time with all the people that are reveling around. Oliver Ridgeway says events like this are crucial for the local economy. Sacramento is just becoming a, a focal point when it comes to large music organizations like festivals and sporting events and um, you know it helps us grow it makes our hotel groups rethink about where they're going to put new hotels and restaurants reporting in sacramento we're built for this so you know come hang out andres valle kcra3 news and visit sacramento sent us a statement tonight saying that these festivals are incredibly important for our local businesses thousands of music fans coming into the city provide another layer of customers for our restaurants hotels retailers and more tickets by the way still available for both those festivals